Hey everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Apocalypse. And uh, we are heading on, we're on our way. We have aliens in the uh, these office buildings over here. And we're on our way to save the day. We are uh, actually landing as we speak. Uh, somewhere in here. Yeah, there we go. Oh, over here maybe. How are you, how are you flying? Are you flying fly a little higher, buddy? There we go. We are now in the offices, here to save the day. All 12 of us, Parallax Tower is the name of the place. So the first mission, um, we have these guys, these the anthropod guys, and they shoot very, very bad things. Search for the building for alien life forms or other hostile forces and gaze the enemy, but where possible, stun aliens using a stun grapple, stun grenade, or psionic power. Live aliens are essential for our research. We can't do that yet, though, because we don't have the biotrans thing on our craft. If all hostile units are eliminated or stunned, then we can recover any equipment in our alien artifacts. A biotransport module must be at the investigation site to enable the recovery of unconscious or dead aliens. That's what I just said. Be careful to avoid endangering any civilians, and remember that the organization which owns the building will not be pleased if there is extensive, da extensive damage to the structure. So the old-fashioned XCOM way of just blow everything up that you possibly can uh, is not really a thing you can do here because these people will be hacked if we go blowing up things and uh we don't want that we want to keep them happy unless it's something like the cult of Sirius, then you know what it's okay we can we can hack them off all we want as far as how i organize these things i have not quite figured out the best way um i just want to make sure there's at least a uh an uh, auto cannon in each group that way i can have explosive ammo and everyone else will just be shooting the other guys okay we're going to do this turn-based because when I get a little more comfortable with the game, I think I can go uh, real time. But for now, I am uh, still in uh, old XCOM mode, so we're going to play it that way. And we have our three squads here. We're going to crank it up to aggressive, and we're going to run with everybody, and we're going to use auto shots. Which we're going to be careful with the auto shots because we don't want to squander our ammo. That is a thing. But we'll be okay. The beautiful thing about this game, they're not the most intelligent people, but we can actually move as a squad, which is fantastic. So we're going to move over to here. We want to kind of make sure we have time units on our people, though, because we don't want to run into the things that are going to be here. There's very bad things. Those, uh, they come flying out of those guns. Very, very bad things. Actually, I guess you guys can move over here. And as I say that, we run out of time units. Uh, okay. I don't think we'll see anything on this first turn. But first turn is done. Uh, maybe you guys should look this way. Uh, whoops. <laughs> That's, uh, whoops. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> All right. Hidden movement. We don't see any aliens right now. And then we get to watch the civilians run around. This is, this is, oh, nice hat, lady. Two of you. You guys both come to work like that? So this is the exciting part of the game. We get to watch the civilians run around and, and freak out. Yeah. Yeah, this is exciting. But as soon as they're done freaking out... Oh, more of them. Look. Look at them all. So many of them. Man. So I think what I'll do is I'll... I guess we'll clear out this level. There's only four levels of this thing. And then we'll move... I guess we can move downstairs after that. Is there even anything down? Oh, there's a door there. Are we still watching civilians run around? There we go. All right. Finally done. Okay, so, um, buddy. Let's go uh, scout ahead. Why do you only have 34 time units? Oh, there's nothing there. And there's people all in here. Okay, we can go. Can you not get through here? Oh, there's a lady with a hat. All right, well, I guess we're going to go here. Oh, that comet, don't do that. <laughs> All right, I'm going to be careful. Why is your time unit so low? Are you overburdened? Um, zombie. You know, you shouldn't. Maybe maybe you are. I might need to lose some things for zombie. He is a bit over. Uh, just go over here. We don't want to, like, block their way out. So hopefully they get out of the way. Now, hopefully I stop shooting them. <laughs> that could be useful. All right, who are you? Scout. Let's go scout. 
Anything yet? Nothing over here? How about in these doors? No, what is this? These are offices? Alright, we'll come take a look over here real quick. I don't think there's gonna be anything in here. We're back over here, and we're gonna run these guys next to you. I'm just gonna come stand next, next to you, and then we'll watch your back. Can you not get in there? There. They will watch your back. If something bad comes out of those doors, they will shoot it for you. Alright, group number one. Let's continue this way. Go ahead and uh, face this way just in case something comes out of those doors. Go. Okay. Next turn again. Nothing. There's one. Oh, uh, somebody shoot it. Somebody shoot. Uh, uh, oh my. Somebody shoot that thing. Please. Please shoot that thing. Thank you. Oh. Please kill them. Please. There you go. Nice. The brain suckers are what we're terrified of. These guys ain't so bad. The, the brain suckers are horrible. Remember Futurama? We had the brain suckers. Yeah, these are worse. Now we get to watch the civilians again. That's my. Who was that? This guy in front here. Is that Scout? Yeah, Scout. Almost got his brain melted, but he resisted. Thanks to somebody behind him. Who's the hero? Who is it? Oh, Horst! Horst is the hero. Um, there's nothing on the ground here, is there? Oh, there is. Oh, my. Pick those up. These are bad. Meridian, please pick those up. And then, um, Scout, take your revenge on this guy. Thank you. Anything on the ground? Nope. Is that it? Is there not another one around here? Yeah, that's all of them. Okay. Let's go ahead and check these doors. Anybody else? Nope. I guess on uh, most of these maps, I guess most of these things spawn typically in the same place, but I don't I don't know it. It's been way too long. And uh oh I don't that's the exit. Oh, that's is it then. Okay, um, can I not go over, no, there's no doors over there. Okay, come back out, guys. Alright, looks like it's clear over here now. Let's scout ahead with, uh, who are you? Space Voyager. Let's scout ahead and see what we see. Nothing there. Anything? No? I think we're okay over here, but we should be cautious. Okay, come back a little bit. And we do need to stand next to you. We must protect you. Never go scouting alone when there's brain suckers around. I think I want you to face this way. Okay, and last squad, which is over this way, which is what, number one? Yeah, let's run this way. I'm gonna guess. The last of them. Oh, where are you going? No. Dang it. Oh, okay. Okay, you can do that. Nothing? Uh, whoops. Oh, 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 oh. Man, misclicks. There, and you can do that. And who are you? Is that all you can move? Yeah. All right. I need to check that door out downstairs. Oh, my. Please kill the thing. I didn't give you very many time units. Oh, nice shot! Who are you? Who are you? Is there another one? Oh, man! You are a hero. You're even more of a hero than Horst is. I don't know. It was on, it was on Scout's head. And Horst saved the day. I'm not sure who the more of the hero is. I guess we're going to find out who gets the promotion. Alright, watch that guy with the green hat. And uh, we got Frank and Jim here. We're going to watch run around. Alright, yes. Run around. Terrified, we understand. So, I'm guessing the other ones are going to be in here. Those guys are just out running around by themselves. I would assume there's an anthropod somewhere nearby. 
All right, all right, all right. We understand you're terrified. But don't come running to me. You don't want to be over here. There's brain suckers over here. That was close. He was the only guy with time units. That uh, so it was, All of our hopes and dreams relied on him. We can't lose a guy on the first mission. That would hurt my confidence. That would be sad. All right. Yes, yes. Run around, civilians. We understand. Man, there's so many civilians on this map. All right. Who is the hero? Who are you? Dark Angel is the hero. And uh, Kazak nearly bit it. Very, very nearly. There is a bathroom. Oh my! There he is. Okay. Take that. I'm gonna guess he can't... Oh, that was it! Nice! We win! Excellent. Horst promoted a squaddy and Scout promoted a squaddy. What? Dark Angel gets nothing? Oh, sorry, Dark Angel. Okay, excellent. Very nice. So, now we get to head back home. And we get some new research, but we haven't finished the first of it yet, so... Not too important. But we're gonna head back to home. You're welcome, Parallax Tower. Let's head back here. And get back faster. And there's really not much else we can do until we get to a UFO showing up. Which will probably happen very soon. Uh, let's see what we... Well, can we research now? Well, we need a biotransport module, of course. And, uh... Oh, we get the, uh, the brain sucker. Um, what's it called? Launcher? Which we can't do anything with. We can sell it. Oh, I forgot. Dieter, get in there. Sorry, Dieter. Alright, yeah, nothing really shows up until we start getting some UFOs. Which will happen very soon. So, let's get those. Uh, ludicrous speed. Here we go. A UFO spotted. First one. Where? Where is this? Out here. Okay, we're gonna get a few of them. Another one. Where? There's number two. These are gonna be all uh, just little scout guys, but we gotta keep an eye on what they're doing, though. Is that number three? All of them are here. And it's gonna be what a um, this is like. This is the firepower. And we got one over here. We don't really care about that guy. Okay, so what we need to do is uh, where is it? Okay, these guys. These um, let's call them potatoes. <laughs> these three uh, are going to unload some troops, and this other little guy, this little guy, is uh, just just there for to shoot things. So we're going to send everyone. And there's a shortcut key, but I don't remember what it is. We're going to attack that one. So never one over here, but we gotta watch him. Because if if we see them uh, unload troops, we gotta mark that that building. We gotta remember that building. Like that, right there. That was quick. Life tree the school. Where is this at the school? Okay, so that building now has aliens in it. Let's keep an eye on that. Um, I guess we could actually... He's already unloaded, so let's hit this one. I don't know if we're going to be able to get any of them before they unload. He's going to head back, which is a shame. Come on, you got to get somebody. Where are we at? Are we anywhere near? Okay. Hoverbikes are showing up. Okay, we're going to shoot that one. He's unloading in the same place. Okay, here. Let's get this one before it unloads. Let's try that. Um, there we go. There we go. Take it down. Nice. It's down. Oh, it's destroyed. All right. Okay. Now, let's go hit... Uh, where'd they go? Are they running off? Let's go hit it before it gets out of here. See if we can nab it. Uh, stop bouncing around. I don't think we're going to make it. It's damaged, but we're not going to get it. Oh, we got it. Nice. Okay, yeah. Get this one. Okay, anything else? Is that everything? We got this one. Where is he at? Okay. 
Everybody, go get this guy. Did we get him? Oh, we did. Excellent. Good job, everybody. Okay. Uh, whoops. I almost did a very fatal mistake. And I didn't unload Mr. Badger here. If Mr. Badger had blown up, that would be a horrible, horrible thing. But since I didn't unload it, we can actually go ahead and go to these places. So, uh, actually, you guys all go home. Which I think you are going home. You guys go home. And Mr. Badger here. We are going to run. We need to get here. We'll clean up these crashed UFOs in a second. We're going to go take care of this school real quick. Um, so, Mr. Badger, we want to go to the school. Because we got to save the day. Now, what you can do, if you leave this alone, then it's too late. You want to grab these while you can. We saw two UFOs unload here, so we know there's aliens here. 